Today's sunshine note is titled, The American Symbol. They pass by like swift ships, like an eagle swooping on its prey. Job chapter 9 verse 26. Various nations around the world use a mammal, bird, or leaf as a national symbol. On June 20th, 1782, the U.S. Congress adopted the bald eagle as the national symbol of the United States. There was some resistance because the eagle has characteristics that are not honorable. Ben Franklin wrote, He is a bird of bad moral character. He does not get his living honestly. Richard B. Morris, a historian, wrote that the bald eagle is a gangster bird, a hijacker, a symbol of espionage, an image of frightfulness. Because the eagle often snatches a fish from an osprey that has caught it or takes prey from other birds or animals that have killed it, some do not look favorably on the eagle. It is reported, believe it or not, that the eagle is the real coward. Yet, bald eagles are very good caretakers of their young. As far as research can tell, they also mate for life. The bald eagle does not get the white feathers on his head until he is five years old. They are a beautiful and stately bird. In past years, the eagle was used as a symbol of imperial might swiftness and brute force. The Persians and Romans carried standards with the eagle symbol into battle. Emperors of Rome bore ivory scepters topped by an eagle, and Native Americans worshipped the eagle because of its beauty. For some time, bald eagles were on the endangered species list because of their fast disappearance. Today, it is estimated that there are only about 7,000 breeding pairs in the United States. Still, bald eagles were taken off the endangered list in 1995. One of the lessons we can learn from the eagles is that they take good care of their families. God is interested in his family and wants to take care of us. The eaglets allow their parents to take care of them. Do we allow God to take care of us? Or do we want to do things our way by ourselves? God will take care of us if we allow Him to. Invite God into your life this morning and ask Him to take care of you. Turn your life over to Him today. They pass by like swift ships, like an eagle swooping on its prey. Job chapter 9 verse 26. May God bless you today.